Well, for the first time on the Dan Nichols Show, I'm somewhere I'm really not used to being, a platinum CrossFit gym here in Linden. It's home to plenty of fitness freaks and home to Sunette Falluan, the Olympic javelin thrower. She's off to her fourth games a little later on this year, and she's the favorite to finally win that elusive gold in 2016. With her today, myself and Chris Forrest, the comedian, a very athletic pair, as we run through Sunette's training regime and try not to end up in intensive care. In this gym itself, I've done a lot of training, a lot of sweat have been put in already. You know, you never know what you're going to get when you're walking to the gym. And that's helped me a lot with my, with my javelin throwing. It makes me extremely fit. And that's what I enjoy, to, to be challenged and, and the, the enjoyment factor. I think that's the, that's the nicest thing. To become the best possible athlete that she can become is quite an easy job for us because we're dealing with an exceptional athlete as it is. So it's more of a tweaking process for us as opposed to trying to build a new, a new athlete and making sure that there's no kinks in her armor. I had my first time in league meeting about two weeks ago in Doha and I threw a new world league and I'm very, very happy with that and there, that is where we are now, currently world number one, going into to Rio. So Ned definitely has her work cut out today, going up against endurance athletes like Dan and Chris. Uh, we're going to have to see if she can keep up. Um, the pacing might be a little bit faster, oh. but her explosiveness will get her through. I can't wait to, to go head to head with them and to see what they can bring to the, to the board today. <laughs> For Chris Forrest, comedy is really a part-time endeavor. He's all about endurance, sport, training, and athleticism. And as you can see, Chris is hard at work today. Oh. Oh. Is that like you've probably been here a couple of hours already, Chris? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I wanted to come and get a decent warm-up just to get the, the muscles going, you know. So endurance, sport, adventure sport, that's really your game? Yeah, sometimes I go for the, the power, you know, explosive power. Things that require a lot of skill. So Sinead Fillion, Olympic javelin thrower, she does a lot of CrossFit. How do you think we're going to shape up against her today? Well, I'm just worried she doesn't hold us back. All right, so we're ready for this. We're off to train with Julian. He's the man in the t-shirt one size too small with an alarming amount of hair gel, and he'll be taking our session today. So Dan and Chris, you guys are going to be one team versus Sinead. You're going to have a relay option. For those of you who knew me, um, I loved all of you, and goodbye. I can't talk anymore. I'm focused. I'm in the zone. Just take the camera away, please. <laughs> so what we're going to do is push the sled all the way up to the first line, turn the sled around, come back. Turn around, go to the second line, and back. Third line, and back. We're going to do it twice, so you each get a turn, where Sunette's going to do two on her own. Ah! Oh, I've got a flash. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to try first. A little bit concerned. Dan and Chris brought the game. But uh, we're going to have to up our game now a little bit with Sunet. Hey, yeah, moving on. You guys can double team that tyre. <laughs> and then Sunet will flip this tyre. And you guys are going to flip all the way there. Just to the end of the black mat. And then flip all the way back. Crossing the finish line over here. Why do we have to go back? Wait. Oh, oh. One more, one more, one more. Well, I went to a school, which was a technical school. They had a very fantastic uh, athletics program. Uh, I didn't do that, but I did go to the motor workshop and I learned all about flipping tires. So much like javelin, this all comes down to technique. We're going to find a point on the tire and try continuously hit that same point. So it's a little bit of accuracy training. 15 strikes over the right shoulder and then 15 strikes Two. over the left shoulder. Now is the ultimate burpee. We're going to do 20 as fast as you can. Thank you. Starting to work hard. I've never been to an Olympic Games. We're sitting at tour at the moment. Uh, despite Sunette's protests, 
And so this is a decider. If we're gonna work as a team, we have to burn 20 calories. And it goes on weight. Uh, so Sinet will put in her weight. We'll put in our combined weight. Chris is 64 kilograms, I'm 63. That's a combination of 217 kilograms. I think we might have the edge. <laughs> we lost a little bit of time in the switch over, but because we're both naturally quite fit, we managed to win it by a small margin. So we're the champions, she's not. And Saskok, if you're watching this, you've got plenty of space on the plane with all the hockey players not going to Brazil. I think you can take me and Chris with you.